Merhaba ya Shabab, which means hello and welcome guys and girls in Arabic. Uh, welcome to my first video uh, where I will explain to you what I'm going to build in the next upcoming tutorial series. So to give you a quick overview, I will build a simple uh, CRUD API which we which is basically a task which will be used as a task app and yeah we will use here Spring Spring Boot as a framework and Kotlin as a programming language and as you can see um, we will use um, a Postgres database which will be provided by uh, Superbase and as you can see I have already stored here some data and now let me just give you quickly a brief overview uh, how the project will be set up. We will have different packages, for instance here a uh, extra package for the cross config, uh, for the controller of course, for for yeah for the data layer, for our models. Here we have our actual task class which will be used as an entity. And yeah, we will also do exception handling when a task is not found, when a bad request is sent. And of course, here we have our repository where we can write, um, let me just minimize that. Uh, here we can write some um, native um, SQL queries, but also uh, JPQL. And yeah, here we have our service class, which has the actual logic inside of it. Um, I will also show you how to set up an application YAML file which will be used as a production YAML file, uh, application file, um, where you see these, these are just environment variables. They, those environment variables um, store our secrets which we not want to expose to anyone. And yeah, I will show you how to set it up with your IDE if you use IntelliJ and of course when we do local development we will use um, a docker container which runs on a Postgres uh, docker image and of course we will do um, unit testing for the repository class um, for this, uh, as well as for the uh, task service class and of course integration tests for our controller and yeah, then we will do some manual testing stuff. Let's just let me sh see if everything runs. Yeah, yeah. Now we here we see the, um, the application is running. We have some log messages here and some custom logs are added, which means hello and welcome to all of you. And uh, just see now if we can um, uh, if this works. Yeah, uh, we can set up some some get requests here. For instance, I want to get the task with the ID free, and if I take for instance the task with the ID fifty five, yeah, as you can see, we get a custom message um, a four hundred four that the task with ID uh, fifty five does not exist. I will show you how to set it up. And yeah, as you can see, we have all the basic CRUD operations here, get, post, um, patch, and delete. And yeah, and if you prefer to, 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 uh, if you prefer to have a written tutorial, I will also provide you here in the description a written tutorial on medium.com. So yeah, if you are excited as, as me, I would say let's start with the first tutorial. Thank you, Ilalika.